Me, your host, Alex. And me, Annabelle. Can you turn your phone off for a start? Can you shut the fuck up? Because that's part of it. Yeah, yet again, delegated the agenda task to you. So, (laughs) let's get the ball rolling. Didn't nor get an agenda nor. Oh, a few shout-outs. Tommy, just that Oh, we're doing that. Well, we just wanted a shout-out, so no one else asked, so no one else gets. Oh, and Jimmy as well, because he has shown a lot yeah, of Jimmy. love on the old group chat. Yeah, our number one pervert. Yeah, just one of the boys. Um, oh, by the way, we, they don't know what we're drinking. Oh, come on. <sighs> Couple <of> Nelsons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 that's it. If you know, you know. No, I'll explain it. Yeah, <laughs> You should. Oh, should you say should? Ooh, <laughs> oh, should back you reft know? at you three. Should, yeah, you should. No, you should know what a Nelson yeah, is yeah, by yeah. now. The pressure's on. I'll tell you, if you don't know. A Nelson... Definition of is a Stella and Nelson Mandela. Yeah. Thank you. Artois, if you will. A Stella Artois, yeah. yeah. It doesn't rhyme with Mandela, does it? No. So Nelson Mandela. Stella. Yeah. Mandelas. Um, gondolas. What are gondolas? <laughs> gondoliers. What are they? They're like rowers in a canoe. A couple of gondoliers, a couple of beers. Here's another one. <laughs> What's the weirdest thing you've seen sold out in shops? I was trying to look for um, whole grain nuts, sir. You couldn't find them. Sorry? Whole grain nuts. Who? <laughs> Whole grain nuts. And where are you going to put them? <laughs> What's that then? <laughs> the nuts. Probably in my mouth. Are they? Yeah. Probably put the nuts in my mouth. Yeah. So that. A whole grain nuts? Yeah, I can find it. Literally the most boring answer you could have given. Well, what have you seen sold out what's, then? Uh, what's, what's it, what have you seen sold out? Um, I was looking for some whole Sorry, is there nuts. an exciting answer to this? Magnums. You can decide which one. Magn- <laughs> <laughs> you decide. <laughs> you decide. Put in the comments which Magnums were sold out. Yeah. Look out. Mm. Well, what was it? Uh, tell me off air. I didn't see Magnums. I just. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta leave that in now. You gotta leave that in now. <laughs> that is so good. Oh, God. Yeah. The next question from uh, Robin, our cousin. Our father, who was <laughs> um, is... She's not our father. No. <laughs> How do you think things will be different when we emerge from lockdown? Oh, With the bodies in the floor. Good question. Heavy question. I think we'll all be closer as a community. Cute. Because we're all... Well, most of us are looking out for each other. Still some dickheads in the park, etc. Yeah, true. Actually, band. we've mentioned Tommy... He called the police on his local I saw, park, yeah, on his and, Instagram. Uh, yeah, and he tagged the police on Instagram, which yeah. I didn't think they had on Instagram, but here we are. Doing God's work. Yeah. <laughs> so congrats. Yeah. I Keep mean, doing that, perverts. If you see any pervs yeah. or other in parks. Yeah, guy, perverts. If you're seeing any pervs, right, this goes for... <laughs> any walk of life. Yeah. In your house, yeah. your garden. In your bathroom. <laughs> peeping through They your... love it in the bathroom. <laughs> Then, you know, call the fuzz, you know, call Under the police Undercover bacon. Them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, God, the flashing lights. <laughs> yeah, so what you think what will be closer question? as a community? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's going to change? Yeah. I think especially for the first few months, people will just be out a lot and everyone will be seeing each other and doing loads of stuff. And like, and all the Instagram captions are going to be like, it's been too long since I've seen this girl. Or like, you know. Mm. You don't think people will be scared to go out still when it first breaks? Well, that's what I was thinking. Like, how how is it going to just be lifted? Like, how is it? I don't know. Is it going to be a gradual process where, like, you know, the low risk people can go back to work and stuff, and then the medium risk and the high risk, and then like, how do you police what level? Will it risk still be at? like? Will we still have to stay meters apart? You can't we really can go police. Out, like, you can't police like, what risk you're at. They can't no. stop and go. What percentage of risk are you at? And are you allowed out? You're just gonna have to let everyone just run free. Mm. Just the Venga Boys all... I think that's, oh, that'll please. be the thing. It's just Venga Boys will be playing just all that's over it. the UK. Like just actual at the same Venga time, buses we'll... just flood the yeah, streets. Yeah, 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 exactly. Um, oh, it's going to be naughty. Yeah, I know. But yeah, it's going to be really weird. Like, how is it? Because surely it's not just going to be one day that they're like, right, guys, you can leave now. <laughs> <laughs> Stop throwing stuff at me. It's distracting for the perverts. Mm. I think a lot of relationships as well. Are you trying to do this? <laughs> Wait, I am. How did you do that? <laughs> Please go. stop. Sorry. I remember my first beer. <laughs> um, yeah, I think a lot of relationships will... Peter. Will, it will be like make or break. Peter out. I think a lot of them will break up. Wow, that's really dark. Why Why were you saying Peter? 
they'll peter out. <laughs> I don't get it. That's a phrase, cunt. What? They'll Relationships peter will peter out. out. Peter out? Are you done? I've never heard that. Are you feeling all right? The Are phrase you? peter out. Literally never fizzle heard that out. Life. Never heard that in my life. Oh, you're going to get slagged off in the comments. Look it up now. I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying I've never heard of it. You That's know. mental. Look it up now. I'm not going to look it up. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I think a lot of people will break up because they'll either have spent too long in isolation together and like the cracks will start to show or they'll realise that they're actually okay without them. Everyone's so going to be so when... thirsty in the club as well. Oh my God, like yeah. any poon you see. Everybody in the club getting tipsy. Oh. Sorry, I'm any be, poon you see. I'm going to be swimming in babes. Please. <laughs> Stop. You're not going to be swimming in babes. <laughs> no, if anything, people will choose more wisely. Yeah. In case this happens again and they have to be stuck inside with someone and they're not going to choose wrong you. wrong decision. <laughs> they choose me. Um, oh, dear. Will people make more of an effort to interact with small businesses rather than huge companies? Because you know the whole, like, support your local recently. Yeah, it's a nice thought. It's just like, as soon as Mackey's opens again, you know they're going there. No, but if you think about it, loads of uh, high street shops are closing down. Like, Debenhams have gone bust. Kath Kidson, like, Sports Direct, yeah. we were saying, WH Smith. Like, so so there's less less, cha- there'll be less chains. Yeah. Yeah. So, less chance of supporting them, then? No, they're the chains, not the independent ones, not the small businesses. Oh, you know, everyone said like shop local, like you know, farm shops, and just like not big chains, independence. Yeah, 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 mad. Do you think that'll happen? Sorry. But... Okay, I can't be asked with you. Um... <laughs> no, I think the conglomerates will shine. Is that okay. a word? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do yeah, you I think... think? I think the big boys will stay at the top. Mm, I don't think get so. even worse potentially. Wait, what do you mean get even worse? Like more people will support them. Now nah, yeah. I beg to differ. No, because like... you seen how many people have put, oh, can't wait for Nando's or whatever. I think people will have more compassion now because they'll know what it's like. And they'll, especially other people, other like workers and people Look, who have it's those... a nice thought. Mm. Just don't think I think you're being pessimistic. Maybe I'm being os- uh, optimistic. Sure. Maybe you're just a dick. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So the main topic I wanted to discuss in this podcast, and it's quite deep... It's a little bit dark, depending on how you look at it. But, you know, we're in this scary situation uh, right now. So my que- Get to the point. So my question for you is, yeah. what is on your bucket list? Oh, buckets. Probably beers with the boys. How is that on your bucket list? <laughs> well, it's ending. It's number one. <laughs> <laughs> one more beer with the boys. <laughs> <laughs> one more? No, I'm joking. Several more beers with several more boys. Mm, bit weird. <laughs> Um, I don't know what's on yours know, while I think about it. Having a swig of Nelson. I want to <laughs> volunteer. Weird phrase. Sorry. Can you? I want to volunteer. I want to travel a lot more. I want to go oh, to. No way. That's outside the box. Travel. Can you? Yeah, but obviously, Ooh. I'm only 18, nearly 19. I want to travel to, you know, New Zealand, Fiji. Like the Scandinavian countries, go back to Amsterdam. Name one Scandinavian country. Norway. Sure. Yeah, because... <laughs> Name fin- another one. Finland. Cool. Is that right? Sweden. Sweden. No. Schwaben. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> donkey schnitzel. <laughs> right, no. What was I going to say? Tits. Oh, yeah. I want to go back to Amsterdam mm. because for the perverts out there that like, don't know, can you just... Stop interrupting me every chance you get. For the perverts out there that don't know, we You're used to live. To weed. <laughs> we used to live in Amsterdam when we were little babies. Is that actually Amsterdam? Yes, what Lauren near Amsterdam. Who? Lauren. That's what it was called. The okay. place we lived. I want to get a tattoo. I want to get my nose pierced. Big I want to get more ear hawk. piercings. I want to get my nose pierced, more ear piercings. Oh, you're cool. I want to have kids. I want to start my own charity. Bloody hell. Uh, you finish it? No, I want to write a book, <laughs> okay. which I'm doing now, actually. I'm, I'm writing a book, You guys. wrote this question. Is this just a chance to show off? What, no, what you. Your... I asked you and you asked me back while you thought about it. So don't oh, go shit, all showy off here about me. I want to jump like, off a right cliff. Now. What? Once I was in um, school in a class and we were going around no. saying what was on our bucket list. No. And I Shit. couldn't work out... Can you... And I couldn't work out how to phrase it, so I said, I want to jump off a cliff. <laughs> and the teacher What's was the like, what? Like, I want to go, like, cliff jumping. <laughs> <laughs> so you got and it so, right, then? No, like, jump into the sea. You know when you, like, jump into the sea off, like, a rock? Right. That's what I meant, not I just want to jump off a cliff. <laughs> 
<laughs> Needless to say, they were concerned until I explained. <laughs> I want to just so many things. I want to like maybe do a concert where I sing. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I know, no people have to wear earplugs. Yeah, just so many things I want to do before I die. Oh, and I just want to be with a boy. Yeah. But, boy, <laughs> I just want yeah. one beer <laughs> with one, one boy. boy. <laughs> Anyone out there? Uh huh. Nah, I want a family of two kids. Yeah. And a wife. Stella and Artois. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> what are you going to name your kids? Well, I always, always like Charlie for the girl. Yeah. Um, And then, I don't know, like Aaron for the guy, for the bloke. Yeah, you I'm want a boy to have a beer with, just have a son. I'm going to get him on the beers instantly. Please don't. Beer so in the baby bottle. Yeah, as soon as he comes out the womb. They're like, we just cut the umbilical like, cord. You're like, what's going on, mate? Do you want a beer skin? <laughs> do you want a fat doob skin? <laughs> <laughs> Enough for him, doob skin. Nah, that's too much. But what Charlie. do you want your wife's name to be? Pete. <laughs> <laughs> don't you want to ask me what my baby names are? Do I? Probably not. What are um, your baby names? No. I know yours. Cucumber. Yeah. What else is on your bouquet list? I said beers with the boys. Yeah. And beer with the A boy. Having a family. And having yeah. a family. Uh, should we be clubbing? That can't be on. Like. I want to. This is like as in the big life plan. Yeah, 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 I know. <laughs> things you want to achieve, things you want to do, you know, things you want to see. I want to, I want to complete clubbing. I want to go to every club in the UK. Mm, I feel like it would be really anticlimactic. Yeah, it would be. And just so much effort. Tell you what, I want to work, I want to do a, a good piece of content with Liverpool and be the lead editor on it. Mm. There you go. I thought you were just going to say I want to do a good piece of content I went, yeah, because I haven't done that yet. Oui, Wee, that's terrible out. chat. Wednesday, Wednesday. Um, yeah, interesting. <laughs> Who's your favourite Liverpool player? No. Uh, <laughs> Virgil van Dijk. Mm. He's Virgil van Dijk. If I got James Milner, Andy Robbo and Virgil in a room, flames. Really? James Milner's up there? Yeah, really? he's so good on camera, yeah. Oh, interesting. Did not get an agenda. Enough. Wait, when you say flames, what would you be doing with them? I don't know. That's the uh, that's the million dollar question. But that's on my bucket list. Tis. Anything else? Uh, that? No, nothing else. Did nor get an agenda. Enough. Beers, wife, Robbo. Fucking beers and boys. Bruce can... <laughs> 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 Sorry, just <clears throat> frog in my throat. <clears throat> Is there any other countries you want to travel to? Somalia. <laughs> <laughs> Mexico. No. Um, I've never been to Italy, so yes, yeah, please. Yeah, I wanted to go to Italy this year, but obviously we're on lockdown. They're Pasta on lockdown. Hmm? Just want to go for the pizza. Yeah, well, the scenery in general in Italy is really nice. I don't, I don't think you should just go for the pizza. And the little boat on the lake. Lake? Yeah, you know, you like go on like little boats through the town. That's in Venice, isn't it? I don't know what the rivers are called. Oh. The canals, isn't it? The River Nile. Oh, I don't know. We're really uncultured, to be honest with you. That one, that seems cool if you went on that. You said Fiji earlier, didn't you? Yeah. Not oh, there. and Hawaii. I want to go down under as well. Yeah. Scunthorpe. <laughs> <laughs> Scunthorpe's north of here, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I've been to Southampton, but I've never been to Scunthorpe. Ah, uh, yeah, Australia, not Scunthorpe. Yeah, you want to go to the land down under. Okay. Sure. Women go in thunder. Bunder? No. <laughs> <laughs> I have another deep question for you. If you were handed an envelope with yeah. the exact time <laughs> and day that you were going to die... No, don't, no, it? fucking wouldn't. Why well, would I want to do that? Definitely wouldn't want to know Well, how. if it was like you die by having too much pussy, then you probably would. <laughs> would be dead already. <laughs> <laughs> No, because what, what if it was, like, in five years' time? I'd be min- Yeah, but then would you live your life? Well, like, I'd probably quit more. my job and just get fucked. Because there's nothing... What, you're basically not living for anything anymore because you know it's coming to yeah, an end yeah, soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good point. But um, do you believe you could you can change your fate? Like, if you knew how you were going to die, do you think you could change it? Yeah. Do you? What? If someone said you're going to get hit by a car... Yeah. You just don't go on the roads. Someone could... <laughs> <laughs> if I'm sitting in the living room, yeah, I'm not getting hit by a car. Window. No, but there could be oh, something that makes it. you Who go cares? into a You're car. Dead. No, but there could be something, you know, someone could be in hospital <sighs> that you love and you'd have to drive to see Why them. Why do you want to know that? You'd be scared every time you'd walk past a car. It's just a conversation starter. It's a shit question. <laughs> what would you do? Don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, Peb. Um, perverts, would you want to know the exact time and date that you were going to die? 
and maybe how as well and do you believe you could change it if so comment down below um we got exactly zero comments on the last one yep <laughs> yeah boy <laughs> another question <laughs> what would um, the nonce be who's your favorite pedophile stop you try and think of one tit actually i need a wazzle teeny weeny where's your beer chinder did you yeah chinderella oh ages um, ago Oh, so I have a question for you. More to be. What would the memoir of your life be called? What the fuck does that mean? If you a wrote book? a memoir, yes. Uh, wait, what's a memoir? It's um like an autobiography, but it's just like individual stories. Top shagger. Cool. The guy who put a smile on everyone's face. That's quite cute, actually. <laughs> I like that. Top shagger was a lot of <laughs> <laughs> Brackets, top shagger. I've been trying to think of mine. Something like baboon. <laughs> baboon. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like mine would be called like trying but failing. Oh. <laughs> okay. We found some deep rooted issues here. <laughs> no, just something like. When you try your best but you don't succeed. I don't know. Well, it, it depends be... on when I wrote it. it. Depends if I failed in life by the time I wrote it. The life. Of a goofy nerd. Mm, I disagree. The tales of the chunky funster. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, we'll end that there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cute. Okay, so I've got a question for you. Mm -hmm. It's a deep one. Mm, hit me. Are you sure you're ready? No. Oh. Um, can money buy happiness? Christ. <laughs> Shit. And is God real? What? <laughs> Can money buy happiness? Yeah, the old, the what age old saying. What I'm going to say is money cannot necessarily buy happiness. Well. But, let, let, let me <laughs> but it can buy time and freedom. Because if you've time. got money, yeah, so if you've got money, you don't necessarily need to work as much. So you've got more time. That also leads into freedom. You can like take more holiday. Just do more things, right? Whereas if you think about someone so who's not got a lot of money... Your answer's yes, then. Huh? Your answer's yes. No, listen. Because you can still be unhappy with a lot of money. Oh. And you can still be happy without money. So money doesn't equal happiness, but it money can, buy, can lead to time and freedom, which can happiness. also buy happiness. But also, it's difficult because there's so many factors that factor into your mental state and your mental health I see it, so it just depends on how much value you place on money. It's whether you're comfortable, whether you, you know, whether it's just like happy little moments or whether it's like you're comfortable. But at the same time, if you've got a lot of money, that doesn't mean that you have to be, that doesn't mean that you're always happy. Like, of course, you know, you can still yeah. have whatever problems going on. But it can <clears throat> buy happiness, can't it? No. If you're sad. What, what are you on? A, I've literally just like. I know, unpacked and that I'm and you're just like go, yeah, yeah yeah so what you're saying is it can <laughs> and I'm like no that's not what I'm saying all you need to do is yes yeah, but that's not right okay so like if you're sad yeah mm. and then you buy a beer oh my god <laughs> <laughs> no no let's go you buy a new jacket yeah you're a little bit happier aren't you that money no, but that, that just that feeds into materialism bought. that's what I was no listen that's what I was talking about with um, like how much value you place on money and I also think because you're one of those people, correct me if I'm wrong, who is just naturally a happy person. <laughs> yes, lad. Yeah, so you obviously would think like, of course money buys happiness because when I get new things, I feel happy. But Doesn't everyone? Not necessarily. You feel sad if you buy new trainers. No, but I might feel guilty that I've spent money on new trainers. Don't buy new trainers. I might... Though. No, but it's so much <laughs> more complex than that. You also, you also see the world quite like binary. Better. No. So, you know, you think a spade is a spade. Probably because it is. Sometimes it can be a club. Sorry? <laughs> or a diamond. Oh, I thought you meant like a spade, like yeah, a castle I don't, and... I don't know if that phrase means like... Wait, a spade and a castle? <laughs> I was thinking like a garden spade. I was thinking like, you know, what you have in at the beach. Oh, like a sand... Yeah, yeah, that's what... Yeah, yeah. yeah. Spade but then and castle. I was also thinking, is it like a spade as in cards, a deck no, of cards? No, it's not. A spade is a spade. Right. Is a spade is a spade. What do so you think that means? Like a garden spade? Well, what do you not, mean? What's the be... phrase mean? 
Oh, this is a spade. This is a spade. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> no, what I'm saying is, sometimes on the like sometimes the surface level meaning isn't the meaning you should take. You know, sometimes you should. Yeah, look I know. Deeper. That's why we're yeah. unpacking this. Right. So what I'm saying is. <laughs> <laughs> so what I'm saying is, obviously, some people will find that money, you know, can lead to happiness because material items make them happy, and that's that. Like, there's that's the simple thing. There's nothing else that goes along with that. But, Full stop, correct. Move right. on. No, but <laughs> some people would prefer to have, you know, shelter, a home, food, just being able to live day to day. No, and then, no, no, listen, listen. No, you've, listen. no you're twisting my worms. No. <laughs> listen, if you're homeless, why would you want a new pair of trainers? It's not going to make <laughs> you happy. That's not what I've it? just said. <laughs> but you said who wouldn't feel happy if they got a new pair of trainers? Oh, nonce. It's going to make you a little happier, isn't it? Even if you're It'll homeless. It'll make you happy. If you're homeless, someone gives you a new pair of trainers, you're like, safety. No, but Love that's... Be like, Ugh. Look, I think this is way too broad of a discussion. This goes into materialism, consumerism, yeah. capitalism. But you wanted to fill out the pod because I've been chatting shit like, for most of it. Like, there is so much to this. And the fact that it's, what, like, midnight and clock. we've both had a beer. <laughs> this is just or not three. the right context to be discussing such a huge topic as can you money were by gagging happiness. for a question but what i'm saying and is now it's... i've laid a heavy question on you and you're bailing out because you can't I'm handle the facts out. i'm spitting oh my you. god shut your i've just given mouth. you truth bombs and you can't handle it no what i'm saying is you're not listening to a fucking thing i'm saying <laughs> what's changed so this is too hard to discuss right now Light okay <laughs> Because it's such a complex thing. It's not as simple right. as does well, it or doesn't. let us know yeah, per in the verse, comments what do you as think? if they got this deep into the pod. Of course they did. If Listen, you got this deep into the pod, give comment us a like. bean burger meal deal in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> the party bus is fully going. Sure. Um, should we wrap it up? You know, wrap it up. That should be a... No, it shouldn't. No. <laughs> <laughs> really shouldn't. <laughs> Don't you know, wrap it up. <laughs> That's our jingle. Wrap it up. Ready? Yeah. We. Oh. Your. Tit. <laughs> cool. Bye, guys. Thanks for listening. <laughs>